So welcome to one dollar present here. This is topic will be asking group technology by Silak Mohar, Ashram Professor, Sevilla Engineering College. This is Blue, Blue Civil College and understand. And this is the definition for the group technology. So group technology is an operation management philosophy based on the recognition that the similarities occurred in the design and the manufacturing of desired parts. Similar parts can be arranged into the part families to implement such a system for, uh, some for some from the classification of parts and the codings record. This is the uh, composition of the part families. One for visual inspection. Next one for the part flow analysis. Next one for the part classification and the coding systems. So part classification and the coding system have the three categories: system based on the design attributes and system based on manufacturing attributes, and system based on both the design and the manufacturing attributes. So these are components for will uh, be used for your design attributes. First one for the basic shapes, and then for ne next one for the so similarity of the product like uh, accessibility and the piece and then seat metal components. Next one for the le uh, length and the diameter ratio. Next for so uh, for major components and the minor dimensions next for the tolerances and then surface finish this is these are the components will come for come under your design attributes next for your parts for the manufacturing attributes so uh, these are things will be there so which are the similar for uh, they going to manufacturing objects for different objects and for the process of the manufacturing next one for the surface the treatments and the coatings they have metal coatings uh, is in the outer surface or inner uh, surfaces next for the water the machine tools will be in common for the for the different objects next for the cutting cutting tools the operation as a sequences the product time and then the batch quantity and then product rates and then fixture needed so these are things will be there so you have to identify so what are these manufacturing attributes common for the parts uh, similar parts next for the coding structure the hybrid structure and then, and then chain type structure and then hybrid structure that are taken off and coding structure will be used there to control your uh, uh, group uh, technology components. So this is a coding system generally used in our uh, real time application from on, only for optic system, understand for the code system and then for KK3 system, then MI class system, then D class system, and then C form. So the, these are the coding system nowadays used in our uh, real time applications. So in, a, in, in our syllabus, we have for optics and then MI class only. So that, that, that only you are going to see in the next slides. So this is for the optic coding system. So have the 9 digit will be there and then 4 alphabets will be there. Now you are going to see the how the uh, first 9 digit will be working here, here that one. So in this one, there is uh, an, uh, the for a specific scheme. There are 9 digit will be there. So both your row and then uh, column. Uh, and then column. So, so for the digit one will be indicated one there uh, this in rotation all non-rotation objects so these are the symbols are there you can able to easily identify this is an uh, rotation or non-rotation objects next one will be indicated for the main shape of the object so which shape will be there there is a circular or square or rectangular or, uh, or in maybe in symmetric or whatever maybe next one is the for your rotational machining next one so for your surface machining Finally, you have additional features you have good added in that one. Finally, you have for the supplementary digits, you have the dimensions, materials, then uh, your raw material shape, and then accuracy. These are things will be going to seen in these uh, last uh, four digits. And uh, this is for the for, for the one, the coding for the first five one. So, digit one, and the digit two, and the digit three, and the digit four, digit five. So you have four classes already known that one. So circular, non circular The external shape they have shape already known that one for thread uh, grooves or uh, any have uh, other uh, function will be there in the uh, external surfaces. This is for the internals also will be there. And uh, this is for your plane uh, surfaces. They have external spine or they have any uh, surfaces slot in internal plane, spine surfaces. And finally it will be there for the were actually holes for in the gear and the teeth they have any circular the pitch pitch dia pitch dimensions whether it's work enough uh, uh, gears use that one so you're going to see in, in that one so this is for that one for the MA classes for your 11 digit one so first digit will be main shape second and third digit will be shape of the element and then fourth digit will be for the say, position of the shape of the element and then five and six will be documents and then uh, so main dimensions seven digit will be dimension ratio eight digit will be actual dimensions nine and tenth will be talents quarters so 11th and 12th will be used for the material course so this is for the main shape so function of your uh, uh, MA class system so these are things will be there so both of your uh, MA class and then optical course system so thank you for watching this video thank you